seniors, you brought this up a little bit earlier. This is going to be your last game on this field. You're going to remember this game for the rest of your life. How do you want to go out? The Palmyra soccer team had its heart set on going out with a big bang in Wednesday's South Jersey Group 1 final, but Shalik, and in particular goalkeeper Harry Snyder, had other ideas. Though the Panthers were clearly the more dangerous team in front of the net, Snyder kept the score at 0-0 through a frustrating first half. We didn't want to give up uh, you know, one goal and, and have to go home today. That was not in the game plan, but uh, we persevered and, and did just enough to uh, advance. At this time of year, that's all you need to do. All day. Kept going, kept tacking, kept pushing, and we knew we'd get one. Palmyra junior midfielder Gio Narwald was the one who ultimately got it as he followed in his own throw in the 60th minute. Deflection, out by, outside the post. Um, came back in, I just shot it, put it back in, took a nice deflection, went in. I was just happy. I'm collecting it, it's mine. I, I don't want anyone to touch it. It's, I'll get it and I'll put it back in and score. The Panthers stayed on the attack even after Narwald's goal. Number six, Raj Bankel used his speed to keep Shalik's backs under pressure and limit the Cougars' ability to push the ball forward. Now looking at their film, we thought that we could pressure them a little bit, and especially with Raj's speed, really pressure their backs, try to turn them in, you know, get some turnovers and some counterattacks. And Raj, whenever we put him in the game, works his tail off. He deserves to get out there and, and play hard, and he almost, almost iced the game for us there in the last few minutes, and he did a great job for us. So they just had me uh, pressure the ball the whole time. Which is good because we got chances, opportunities off of that. We just say, like, keep pressure in the ball. Just try to score, but if you don't, it's fine. Shalik's best chance came off a Palmyra mistake in the 76th minute, but the Cougars put it wide, and the Panthers came away with a 1-0 victory. Palmyra will face Glassboro Friday in the sectional final. I think it's going to be a low-scoring 2-1, 1-0 type game, but uh, we could definitely play with them, and we should be able to beat them. From Matt Curtis Stadium in Palmyra, this is John Lewis.